are I going to be watching Doctor Who, Day of the Doctor? Before we get into it, I am aware of a way to avoid the thumbnail. I've been told in the comments how to do it by clicking on a previous episode and then just skipping until I get to Day of the Doctor. I've been told to look away for once I see Matt Smith's name, I'm actually going to pause the episode and then I'm just going to skip to four minutes or a little bit after just in case. I don't want to accidentally a bit too behind. Yeah, let's get on with it. No, oh, it's the original theme tune. There was a call for you from your doctor. Huh. Cool, cool. I like that. They did the same thing in uh, the movie. <laughs> oh. <laughs> We're on our way. Hello? Unit. Oh, Kate's back. Cool, cool. Wait, she does, she does that in the, uh, I think she does the same thing in the 60th special. I saw an image of the TARDIS being, being done this to it. Oh, pause it, pause it, pause it, pause it, pause it. Fuck, I'm talking too loud. Okay, <laughs> try my best not to pay attention to the Izaki, hopefully. <laughs> 3.59, alright, there we go. Kate Nethbridge Stewart, as I'm sure your father would have told you, I don't like being picked up. Although, I just want to quickly say my room's really dark right now, so if the footage is pixely, I apologise. It shouldn't be, but if it is, I apologise. It should still be watchable. The Day of the Doctor. Alright. Huh? Also known as Gallifrey Falls. Oh. It's <laughs> <laughs> the fall of Arcadia, Gallifrey's second city. It's an oil painting. Oh, wow. Time Lord Art. He was there. He was. Me. The other me. There's one life I've tried to forget. He was the doctor who fought in the Time War. Yep. That was the day he did it. The day I did it. The oh, my God. The, the last day of the Time War. It's happening, man. And that man was me. Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god. Wow. <laughs> Arcadia has fallen. Selga. Oh. I'm going to need your gun. <laughs> Oh my god. The doctor is detected. We have the doctor. Seek. Oh wow. Explain. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, wow, wow. It's like the High Council is an emergency session. It's how I imagined it. Gallifrey stood in the line of fire. He was there then. He left a message. He's a madman. We have a security breach to the time vaults. The moment is gone. The galaxy eater. What the hell? The operating system became sentient. It developed a conscience. There's only one man who would even try. I serve notice on you all. Today, this war will end. How do you work? Somebody there? It's nothing. It's just oh shit! Because it's not a chair. It's the most dangerous weapon. In it's the world. woman I said I don't ever want to see again. <laughs> but it's fine. It's the special. It's fine. Why do you park so far away? You walk for miles. I was miles. thinking. I heard you. you She's so fine. No more. <laughs> no more. No more. Who are you? She's not Rose, because she's acting a lot different than Rose. The interface is hot. Well, I do my best. <laughs> You're the interface. They must have told you the huh. conscience. Hello. Why is it her? You know me. I hear you. I chose this face and form. It's from your past. For your future. I always get those two mixed up. Rose Tyler. Oh, okay. In this form, I'm oh, bad wolf. 
Oh. Are you afraid of the big bad wolf, Doctor? I've lost the right to be the Doctor. Then you're the one to save us all. I intend to end it the only way I can. I have no desire to survive this. Is he wearing the Ninth Doctor's jacket? It looks the same, but I don't think it is. If you kill them all, then that's the consequence. You live. Gallifrey, you're going to burn it. But all those children too. How many children on Gallifrey right now? <coughs> One day, you will count them. Do you want to see what that will turn you into? What happened? Easier to show you. That's not possible. I was just... Why would I take it there? Elizabeth the Fair. You knew her then. Oh, shit. A long time ago. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> I'm assuming we're gonna see him. <laughs> nice, nice way to start it. There you go, Your Majesty. What did I tell you? Bigger on the inside. Oh, it's so nice to see him. Tell me, Doctor. Wow. You have a picnic to eat. You could help me. He looks different. I think it's the hair. The hair's flat. But you have a stomach for war. This face has seen conflict. But it wasn't this face. How dare you? I'm the Queen of England. I like it. It's tied with Alonzi. Elizabeth, will you marry me? Of course I will. Ah, gotcha. Real Elizabeth isn't a shape-shifting alien from outer space. Oh. And you're a Zygon. The real Queen of England would just decide to share her throne with any old handsome bloke in a tight suit. <laughs> and a nice horse. It was the horse. I'm going to be king. <laughs> it's so weird to see him again, but so cool. I don't know why it's weird. I've seen him in 60 special images and stuff. Whatever you've got planned, forget it. I'm from the planet Gallifrey, and, and you are basically just a rabbit, aren't you? Mm. Okay. Doctor! Elizabeth! Step away from her, Doctor. Back! Fight you now! Anything can happen! <laughs> For instance, a fez. Fezes are cool. This way. Welcome to the undergallery. Oi! You! Are you science, eh? <laughs> um, I want this stone dust analysed. Analyze the stone dust. This is why we called you in. The glass in all these paintings has been broken from the inside. Something's got out of the paintings. Lots of something. I remember this. This is where I come in. Geronimo! Oh, fuck. Oh, my God. What the hell? This is going to be so cool. A very skinny. I've never seen it from the outside. It's a very <laughs> special effect. Oh my god. <laughs> Compensating. His elevens is so much better. What are you doing here? I'm busy. Oh, busy. Hello, ladies. Don't start. <laughs> Listen, what you <laughs> this is so cool. Business. One of them is a Zygon. Ugh. Probably a good time to run. Doctor, is that you? Who are you talking to? Myself. <laughs> Can you come back through? Fez incoming! Nothing here. So where did it go? Ah, oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Malcolm, I need you to send me one of my father's incident files. Code named Chroma. You've done all this before. What happens next? I don't remember. <laughs> what? How can you forget this? Well, you're obviously not paying enough attention. Reverse the polarity. They work so well on the screen together. We're both reversing the polarity. Yes. Reversing it, you're reversing it back again. We're confusing <laughs> the polarity. <laughs> oh. You. Looking for the doctor. Well, who are you boys? Are you his companions? Companions? <laughs> they get younger all the time. Really? In that one? Yes. You're <laughs> my, am I having a midlife crisis? <laughs> it's very comedic. Like the, the episode, I mean. I think there's three of them now. What is that? They're screwdrivers. What are you going to do? Assemble a cabinet at them? <laughs> <laughs> Doctor, what's going on? Timey wimey thing. Timey what? Timey wimey. <laughs> I've no idea where he picks that stuff up. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Take them to the tower. That is not the Queen of England, that's an alien duplicate. <laughs> Why are we all together? Well, me and Chinny, we were surprised, but you came looking for us. Chinny? Yeah, you do have a chin. Oh shit. We have to go right now, this minute. <laughs> They are disgusting. Excuse me. What the hell? Okay, I know I know what happened there. <laughs> they were taking her form. I'm going to need access to the black archive. Access, please. 
No. The whole of the tower is TARDIS proofed. We have to screen all his known associates. What is that? A vortex manipulated the Captain Jack Harkness on the occasion of his death. Well, one of them. No one. Mm. Can... Should they be here? Why have they followed us? Probably just finished disposing of the humans a bit early. Dear me. Really oh. Oh god. Oh, we might as well get started. Help to pass the timey wimey. Do you have to talk like children? <coughs> the way you both look at me, what is that? It must be really recent for you. The time war, the last day, the day you killed them all. It's history for them. Four decided. I think their future oh, is real. They can't see her. Go on, ask them. Ask them what you need to know. Did you ever count how many children there were on Gallifrey that day? I have absolutely no idea. In all that time, you never even wondered how many there were. 2.47 billion. You forgot? 400 years, is that all it takes? Where can you be now that you can forget something like that? Spoilers. No. <laughs> I would like to know where I'm going. No, you really wouldn't. I don't know who you are. Know what you become if you destroy Gallifrey. The man who regrets and the man who forgets. The moment is coming. The moment is me. You have to decide. It's the same screwdriver. Same software. But at a software level, they're all the same device, aren't they? If you really are me with your sand shoes and your dicky bow, <laughs> we are incredibly clever. How did you do that? It wasn't locked. Right. Oh my god. Why wasn't it locked? Because I was fascinated to see what you would do upon escaping. Okay. <laughs> I, for now, I don't know why we're spending so much time with these two. I wish we were spending more time with the doctors. Observe this. I believe you will find it fascinating. They're stored in the painting. We like cup of soups. And you know why I know that you're a fake? It's not just the smell. The real Elizabeth would never be stupid enough to reveal her own plan. It's not my plan. And I am the real Elizabeth. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> A moment, just to some <laughs> Can I rely on your service? Well, I'm going to need my TARDIS. You have a promise to keep. I now pronounce. Oh my God! <laughs> there are a lot of this in the future. It does start to happen, yeah. I will be right back. <laughs> He's out. <laughs> Oh wow, it's so... Well, I can't really use the word nostalgic because I'm watching it not the same speed as you guys did, but it feels nostalgic. The round things. What are the round things? No idea. <laughs> they work so well together, both of them. Stabilize. I don't like it. Oh, you never do. Listen, we're going to the National Gallery. Unit HQ, they followed us there in the Black Archive. The way they all turned. There's a nuclear warhead 20 feet beneath us. Yes, I, so far, I'm going to say so far because it might change, but so far I don't care about this side story with Kate. I'm sure it's all going to connect, but I just, I don't really care about it. This is not a decision you will ever be able to live with. Listen to me! Tower of London, totally TARDIS proof. We don't need to land. There is another way. Cup of soup. Hmm. Is cup of soup. What happened? Easier to show you. Take a look at your phone. Oh, okay. I need you to send the Gallifrey Falls painting to the Black Archives. Nice. Wow. <laughs> Their scream. Oh, wow. The theme. Also, the show enough. <laughs> and they work so well together. What I did that day was wrong. And I'm going to make you how. Whoops, <laughs> what Yeah, work so well together. Peace in our time. Oh shit, nice. We haven't really met yet. I look forward to it. He's always talking about the day he did it. One would. You wouldn't, because you haven't done it yet. It's still in your future. Are they going to change the future? We'll change that sure point. He regrets it. He'd do anything to change it. So much younger. And then all things considered, the time I grew up, seen all I needed, the moment has come. I'm ready. I know you are. Who are you talking to? Oh. 
I think that is the ninth Doctor's jacket. If it's not, it was heavily inspired by it. Are you sure? There is no other way. Those men, extraordinary. They are the Doctor. You know the sound the TARDIS makes? That sound brings hope wherever it goes. To anyone who hears it, Doctor. Even you. Wow, two. <laughs> That's so cool. Go away now, all of you. These events should be time locked. Don't think let us through. You clever boys. <laughs> Go back. Go and be the doctor that I could never be. All those years burying you in my memory. Pretending you weren't the doctor when you were the doctor more than anybody else. But this time, you don't have to do it alone. Wow. Thank you. It is done because there is no other way. Huh. What is it? What? I never pictured you doing it, that's all. It's a projection. These are the people you're gonna burn. There isn't anything we can do. We've got enough warriors. An old idiot can be a hero. Then what do I do? What you've always done. Be a doctor. Huh. You told me the name you chose was a promise. What was the promise? Never cruel or cowardly. Never give up. Never give in. You're not actually suggesting that we change our own personal history. We change history all the time. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> you do it all the time. I have had 400 years to think about this. I've changed my mind. There's something those Daleks don't know. This time there's three of us. That is brilliant. I'm going that too. That is brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> she told me exactly the future I needed to see. Who did? Bad wolf girl, I could uh. kiss you. Yeah. That's gonna happen. Sorry, did you just say bad wolf? Oh. But where would Gallifrey be? Frozen, hidden away. Like a painting. <laughs> I've said it so many times, they work so well together. What's the mad fool talking about now? This is the doctor speaking. Also the doctor. All my worst nightmares at once. <laughs> We're going to freeze Gallifrey using our TARDISes. Calling the War Council of Gallifrey. This is the doctor. Good luck. Oh, it's so cool to see that. For my next trick, my ah, cool. All 12 of them. All 13. Oh! Sir. Oh, shit! That was so unexpected. <laughs> Do it, Doctor. Do it. We're ready. Geronimo! And I'll see Gallifrey stand! I don't suppose we'll ever know if we actually succeeded. What is it actually called? Either no more or Gallifrey Falls. How did it get here? No idea. Look at the this the three Tardis oh, is there. <laughs> so cool. It has been an honor. Likewise. Doctor. I won't remember this, will I? I won't remember that I tried to save Gallifrey. I guess they have to do that for continuity. I have to live with that. For this moment, I am the doctor again. Thank you. Which one is mine? Pretty obvious if you look at it, it's all busted up. <laughs> oh my god, we're wearing a bit thin. Um, fuck off. I thought they would show us. I'm assuming the ninth doctor. You might as well tell me. Tell you what, where it is we're going that you don't want to talk about. I saw Trenzalore, where we're buried. We die in battle among millions. That's not how it's supposed to be. Trenzalor is where you're going. Oh, not to say nothing. Good to know my future is in safe hands. Mm. We need a new destination because I don't want to go. <laughs> Final words. He always says that. I don't know why I laughed at that. I think that's supposed to be a bit sad. There was an old man looking for you. I think it was the curator. I could be a curator. I could retire and be the curator of this place. You know, I really think you might. Oh my god. It sounds like the fourth doctor. I never forget a face. I know you don't. And in years to come, you might find wow. yourself revisiting a few of the old favourites. Huh. It's all one title. Gallifrey Falls No More. It worked. I'm only a humble curator. I'm sure I wouldn't doubt. There was. <laughs> Where is it indeed? Yes. Lost. Shh. You have a lot to do. Do now go looking for Gallifrey. Well, it's entirely up to you. Oh my god. Your choice. Eh? I can only tell you what I would do if I were you. Oh, <laughs> perhaps I was you, of course. <laughs> <laughs> or, or perhaps it doesn't matter either way. 
Who knows? Who knows? Hmm. Nice. That's so nice that they brought him. Clara sometimes asks me if I dream. I dream about where I'm going, but you're not going anywhere. You're just wandering about. Oh, so wow. I have a new destination. Home. Wow. Wow. All right, so that was pretty good. A few things I didn't like, but overall, really good. I really enjoyed it. So I'll start with the good things I liked. I, the three Doctors work really well, like really well, especially Matt Smith and David Tennant work really well together. The chemistry is really good. Seeing Rose come back or the moment working in there as well cool even though i've said in my series 4 finale that i don't want to see her again she wasn't like rose she was like this other thing this other sort of being so that was pretty cool seeing the time war was really cool i do wish i'll get more into things i didn't like about that but um overall it was a great doctor anniversary sort of special where three doctors work really well together i also liked how they sort of changed the future now obviously with continuity they have to make sure the doctor doesn't remember that but also the ending of gallifrey and going there and stuff like that i feel like that's really interesting oh my god i pia capaldi <laughs> as the doctor i i completely i would have forgotten if i didn't think of that it just came out of nowhere was it all 13 he said all 13 wow like out of nowhere and they focused on the eyes so cool like i'll it's just like so out of nowhere i didn't expect it at all um obviously i knew he's the doctor after matt smith but i didn't expect like him to be in this I, I didn't expect any of them to be in this but like obviously knowing that people want me to be away from spoilers i assumed that something was gonna happen but him appearing in this out of nowhere did not expect that it's so cool that they did that's so cool tom baker i don't know if he's playing the doctor as well as the curator or just the curator like they just brought him um but i feel like they were nodding at him playing the doctor i think well he wasn't actually the doctor but i like how clara helped the doctor make the decision of not destroying gallifrey or whatever um, you know, it is a theme of the companions making the Doctor do the right thing or doing the humane thing. So it was nice to see Clara do that. So overall, really fun. I think the Doctors are the strong point of this, the chemistry between them. Things that I didn't like, I thought the stuff with the Zygons and Kate, waste of time. Huge waste of time. Didn't care about them. Cool to see Kate, but I felt like a story. That whole Zygon-Kate story, waste of time in my opinion. I wish we'd just spend the whole episode with the Doctors. I wish that we got to see Christopher Eccleston. Really hope that there's, a, there's like a YouTube video of some fan edit where they've edited Christopher Eccleston onto him and like just done some sort of fan regeneration and putting his face on there. If there is, please send a link. I really want to see that. I'll probably react to it as well. Also, another sort of weak point is this This heavily relies on comedy. To You have to laugh and in, to in fully, fully enjoy this. And something about me is I can't rewatch something that just relies on comedy. I loved Thor Love and Thunder in the cinemas. When I wanted to rewatch Love and Thunder, I couldn't get through it because I've already I already know the jokes, I already know the comedy, so it's hard to rewatch. And I think I'm not saying it is, but I think I couldn't rewatch this and enjoy it the same amount because it does rely heavily on the comedy and the comedic chemistry between the three doctors. But still, on a first watch, it's really fun. It's a great, it's a great anniversary, which is the whole point of this. And it's also, I believe, the ten-year anniversary this came out. Also, happy sixtieth to all of you. Happy birthday to Doctor Who. I, I forgot to mention that at the beginning. Happy sixtieth. And also, also the time war thing. I wish we saw more of the time war. Like, get rid of all the kids Zygon story and give us more time war stuff. The stuff we did get was cool, but I do wish we got more of it. I wish we got to see more of the council, the war council. You know, maybe something sort of Game of Throny, House of the Dragonies, like a little bit of that, because it is a war and stuff like that. And it did feel like Game of Thrones, House of Dragon, that sort of setting. It would have been cool to see something like that if they put more focus on that instead of the Zygon Kate thing. But yeah, that's what I like and what I dislike. Overall, a good good the whole it's an anniversary special so it does its job of being a good doctor who anniversary thing but on a rewatch i don't know if i would enjoy this as much as on a rewatch also the way they do bringing characters back with rose in this i'm fine with it because one it's an anniversary special and two it wasn't like fully 
Rose Tyler was like this being, this moment being, which is what they did any with some of that they did in at the end of series one with the I can't remember what it was, but she was sort of that thing at the end of series one. But yeah, it was cool that they put a twist on it. It wasn't just Rose Tyler, it was the moment. Um, but yeah, but there's no, nothing else I can really say. Just hope you guys enjoy the uh, 60th special that is coming out this Saturday. I don't know why they're not just releasing it today, but um, it's coming out on Saturday. Also, tomorrow I'll be watching An Adventure in Space and Time, and then on Monday we'll do Time of the Doctor, which I believe is Matt Smith's regeneration, so that's going to be interesting to see. Cool, I enjoyed it. Can't wait to watch more. <laughs>